Why am I doing this to myself? Never mind. Hey everybody, it's Sherry. I am back, not in the kitchen today, because we're doing something a little different, something a little exciting. Okay, I think that you might be able to guess based on these really brightly colored packages in front of me. I'm gonna be taste testing some real OG Easter candy. Mostly peeps here. I have how many flavors? One, two, three, seven different flavors. And just for fun, I picked up a magical Easter unicorn. You know the one, right? The the very well-known, beloved, magical Easter unicorn. So happy Easter, everybody, whoever celebrates Easter. Okay, this is embarrassing, but I actually like peeps. I think it's just all about the texture. They're, I like the crunchy sugar coating, and then you bite into it, and it's this like chewy, marshmallowy gooiness. And even as a kid, I knew how disgustingly unhealthy. And I don't know what these eyes are made out of. Let me read this, these ingredients. Sugar, corn syrup, gelatin, carn, carna uba, carna uba wax. Carnaba. That's probably what the eyes are made out of. Carbonu, carna uba wax. That's probably good for you. Satisfaction's guaranteed. So I'm um, so very excited to try these peeps, but did, did y'all know about the magical Easter unicorn? Cause I had no idea. I, I knew about the bunny, but then once my eyes met this birthday cake colored, look at this, look at this guy. He is dying to get out. Oh, oh, it's Easter already? Nay idea. Looks like there's a craft in here. But before, before anything, magical Easter unicorn. What is your unicorn's name? This is what my unicorn name is. S Sassy, and I was born in April. Sugar pumpkin. Sassy sugar pumpkin. Okay. So we have this, like the the eyes, the uh, the eyes. You have like the horn, and I don't know what this is. Like, is it? It's just it's just like magic. It smells good. Uh, oh, it's the hair. Okay, let's cut this. Do unicorns grant wishes? I wish for a real unicorn. Okay, so we have the eyes, and then we gonna put. Ooh, this is actually so fun. So we got her little swoop. And then we have, and then we will add the ears right here. <laughs> this is really coming together. Got some chopsticks. <laughs> I mean, should we take our unicorn out to try it? Ooh, there's stars on the butt. We have. Okay. Mmm, mm, that's good. Mm, so sweet. It's hollow. Nothing in there, but she's cute, right? <laughs> there we go. We're gonna start by trying the original. Ooh, these are some fresh peeps. We got, we got those fresh peeps. This is not after Easter, 50% off. I paid full price for these peeps. 
Okay, let's try the original. I know what these taste like, but mm, gotta have a base. The texture. Got the other ear. And then let's try the candelua wax or whatever. Candelua. Is it like candle wax? Carnaba. Crunchy. Okay, good. Nothing like that extraordinary about the flavor. This pretty much tastes like a regular marshmallow, but it is really soft. So, okay, I need soft because like uh, I have more. I don't know. I'm not even gonna rate these right now, or I'll give them a ten. <laughs> I don't know. Next up is Peeps Fruit Punch. Burst into fun with a deliciously refreshing taste of fruit punch flavor. Okay. Let's freaking do it. Express your peepsonality. That's not that good. This doesn't smell good. This guy. Uh, ew. Oh, boom. Actually, that's not that bad. The, the middle is pink. It tastes like a fruit candy, but in marshmallow form. Marshmallow Starburst, give it an eight out of 10. Next up, we have Cotton Candy, classic carnival flavor. Look how cool these look. This is actually awesome looking. What? Little like blue candy specks that look uh, like little shards of glass. And that's probably what they are. Let's dig in. Eat your face off. <gasps> Pink in the middle. What them? Yep. I like it. Dang, should I give it a 10? I mean, they're so good. Yeah, 10, 10 out of 10. Cotton candy is what peeps should taste like. I'm gonna finish this. Next up, hot tamales, fierce cinnamon. Get fired up with the cinnamon flavor of hot tamales and peeps marshmallow. Two classic candies come together in one sweet and spicy treat. Not gonna lie, I'm not looking forward to these nasties. Marshmallows and cinnamon? Nah, like what kind of deal did you guys get with hot tamales? Cinnamon belongs in gum. So I'm scared. Hey, I'm a hot tamale. I like doing that. It actually like barely tastes like cinnamon. I think it smells more like cinnamon than it tastes like cinnamon. Beer cinnamon? I don't think so. What what were the lies you told? Sweet and spicy treat? No, it's not. Seriously, if you were gonna go for cinnamon, you should have went hard because it's just a red peep with a cinnamon scent, okay? If somebody was excited about a cinnamon flavor, they would be a little bit disappointed. Okay, I'm happy it didn't taste gross, so let me give these a five. Like, these don't need to exist. Next, we have sour watermelon. I'm obsessed with sour candies, and I love marshmallow texture, so this might just be a winner. It's a green bird with pink in the middle. I want to separate this. Oh. It's sour. This tastes like a watermelon candy I've tried. The watermelon Jolly Rancher. Yeah, jo watermelon Jolly Rancher, or they have that watermelon flavor, Bubblicious. This is surprisingly good. I'm into this. This is different. This is not what you expect out of a peep or any kind of marshmallow candy, but I like what it's doing. I like what it's doing. And it went for it. It said it's sour, and it was sour. Hot tamale. 
they get a 6.5 and I'll tell you why. It seems pretty low for something that I actually enjoyed, but uh, maybe I should give them higher. I'm gonna give them a seven, okay? I'm gonna give them a seven because this flavor is not what I particularly look for when I want some marshmallow goodness, okay? I'd rather have a straight gummy candy like a Sour Patch Kid or even a Jawbreaker. For what they are, they're good. And they impressed me, but they really worked hard to make it look like an artificial watermelon and they did that. And, and and the points don't matter. Dum dum dum. Let's pretend that this ain't even a flavor. Is this a joke? Is this a practical joke or what? Um, and I'm just saying root beer in general. Disgusting. It's the root of all evil is what it is. Enjoy a classic treat with the sweet taste of root beer flavor. <laughs> okay, they didn't even try that hard with that one. Okay, because they have nothing to say. And it's supposed to like, what is it? It's supposed to be like beer for kids? So it does nothing for you. It just tastes bad. It doesn't get you buzzed. Okay, I don't know why I'm so upset about it. Honestly, because I'm upset. Because why would you make candy flavors bad? Why? It's like black licorice. Um, I... You okay? You all right? Okay, I just have to check in. Do you see like a green tint going on? Cause it's like the brown, but it has like a greenish tint. So that's appetizing. Yeah, this guy looks pretty happy. Should we bite his head off? Oh God. I'll, I'll say it's still a subtle flavor, but it's stronger than the cinnamon was. Like the root beer flavor, I can taste more than I tasted the cinnamon. I'll even get another bite just in case anything else comes out. Oh, worse. Why? Why? Oh my God. How'd that get worse? Did I eat just... The grossness is packed in on the bottom. Okay, so that's done. Um, what do we do? Yeah, no, this one's gonna be easier to judge. No confusion here, uh, not a fan. We're gonna give this a, a two, because I didn't throw up, okay? And I thought I would, so there you go, that's the point. Approaching the end with Party cake, baby. Party it up with the sweet taste of vanilla cake flavor. Vanilla cake. <laughs> I'm sorry. A snip test. This smells like a freaking cake. <laughs> hey y'all, looking real cute. Let's show. Let's show everybody. Let's show up. <gasps> oh sh. Hey, I just realized something. Siblings, they're related. We got birthday cake flavored guys. Birthday cake flavor, who knew? It's really like taking over the whole candy world. Let's see, there we go. Ugh, oh, I'm gonna give up in two seconds. Yeah, it's really hard to see. There we go, yeah. All right, let's eat these guys. Oh, let me keep with the theme of biting their faces off. Very good. Very good. Of course, right? We're not surprised here. And inside, you might not be able to tell, but it is a pale yellow color. That of a party cake, perhaps? Let's just do a stretch. I don't know. Anybody into this? So, I really like this. And it's definitely the, the contender for top number one peep flavor. I need a palate cleanser though. <laughs> Little unicorn booty. <laughs> I think we're gonna give it to cotton candy. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, cotton candy's the winner. <laughs> Tubby, tubby. <laughs> tubby, tubby. 
Don't know. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this. This was interesting. <laughs> this was fun though. I mean, I, I never had the excuse to try this much candy at once as an adult, so that's pretty cool. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I had such a great time. Remember to comment, like, subscribe, hit the notifications button so you can find out when the next video gets posted. And just thank you so much for watching. I can't wait to do it again with you. Bye.